Hello everybody, I am Braveman19 and welcome to episode number two of our Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth campaign in season two of Empire Total War. Um, last time, Austria, uh, as we were building up a very, honestly, it was a pretty good economic base, uh, Austria said, you know what, they look weak, they're going to come after him. So he went from Silesia straight at my capital, attacking stuff along the way. Uh, so we're building up our army a few turns earlier than I wanted. I was about to have my army and push on Ottomans, but uh, that's okay. This is the way it's going down. I can see if Austria will take a piece, just for fun. Will you? Nope. Okay, that's fine. And uh, But we're going to build up our army, and we'll deal with this guy. I don't think he can attack us uh, very well, because we have a ton of support in our capital. So uh, And we're building up an army while we're at it. So, all right, let's go ahead and end the turn. But uh, yeah, guys, hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, it's going to be interesting. Oh, he is going to try to do this attack. We have uh, 852 against his 1170, but we're on the defense. His army is not good, but we are untested. So let's see if we can beat him. The enemy will try to smash their way Okay, we're not going to worry about this so much. Um, I don't really care about my demi cannons, if I'm at all honest. They can sit right here and die. Um, bring our Lancers inside. Lancers, General. Let's end the turn and see what happens. They do have Demi Cannon out here. And I think they have it over here too. Fast forward. What happened with him? Something shot into his own General's. Go here. He's down to 36. 27. It's okay. He's just hitting Demi Cannon. We expected him to do that. They've launched their men away from their cannons because they cannot reach our positions. That's important to know. Go ahead and get ready to shoot again. You lost seven guys, but the cannons are still active. Okay, we're still trying. Let's fast forward this battle along a little bit. Here they all come. I don't know if they're bringing to the sides or not. It's hard to tell. I know this though. I'm going to bring this guy to here. It'll make me feel better. Um, we're going to move this guy over here. And this guy is going to come move here. There we go. We're going to hit these guys in front of us. Wavering and broken. Broken. Let's see if we can shatter them pretty quickly. He's just broken. That's all it is. Shoot at that. Let's see if maybe we can hit that whole line or something. I don't know. I need you to run to position. These guys just forgot how to attack, I guess. Alright, don't worry about it. These guys aren't doing anything at all. But we have been damaged a bit. It's weird. Guess we'll fast forward. Yeah, they are coming back.
These look like Pandoras, so if we can hit them hard. Let's try to get some men out and do something. Let's take these. Alright, they're going to get closer over here. Might get some more guys involved in killing some enemies. He's at 38. Not very good morale, of course. He's got to 20 and he's wavering. Broken and shattered at 18. We've got two units here. Now my goal is pretty simple. Come on, open the gates and let me out here to come hit them as they come up. That would literally be the best thing I can do. Come on, open the gate, open the gate, open the gate. Hey, what are you doing? Open the gate. Jeez. Oh, see, so you're going to screw it all up. Goodness. Fast forward it. I mean, this is taking too long. Let's go hit him. Kablamo, there you go. Um, if these guys are broken. They're, these guys are wavering and coming back. back here we lost one guy to kill 30 something of him maybe I'm gonna fast forward it a little bit because we're still dealing with this battle which is probably gonna last all day and all night the way it's going take positions Let's go take advantage of this situation and fire on him. Yeah, he's lost 20 and he hasn't even gotten to us. We can get in a position. Sit both of these right here. You're firing up at me and can barely even touch us. Yeah, they did move some men down here. He's being picked off a lot. Come on, men. Come 
these guys are about to be assaulted. Let's move up and help them. And we've lost two to kill 36, or 46, excuse me. Run two, let's get over here, come on. They're at 94 right now. Open the gate. The way I see it is I can sweep into him and keep sweeping around if they'd let me out the gate. There he goes. Just let me out now. Let's get him. And now he's down to 60. He's broken and shattered. Let's go this way. over there all these boys are getting out these guys are coming up these guys are having to handle it by themselves you to come over here these guys in here let's hit these hit those we're almost in position here we're active stop it from hitting here Okay, we're going to come around over here. Move around over on this side. Let's hit these guys in the rear now. Maybe we can push them to get rid of them. These guys are coming up and we're doing a pretty good, decent job of stopping them. These guys are now broken. And they're shattered. Go there. We're tired, but they're tired as well, so let's keep it going. 88 on 103. 83, there you go. Just keep pushing them, breaking them. Let's shatter them while we're at this. Yep, now they're shattered. Let's pull out of this attack and let's come here. I need you here as fast as you can be. I need you here as fast as you can be. These guys are already wavering, it should hold. I'm going to fast forward just a little bit to move some men around. I'll try to meet up here. They're on the ground, so uh, go ahead and go try to hit them. He's just pikemen out here, that's not going to be good to try to walk on to. Alright. If we can get here, we can hit these guys before they even try to get up and stop them. Oh yeah, they know we're coming. Yep. Technically getting hit in the flank. 
are shattered. These guys are shattered. These guys are shattered. These guys are broken. Still broken. We just need to keep our boys right here. They are very tired. We are tired and winded. Stop. Decisive victory. It was a hard fought victory. We lost 205 to kill 718. That was a great defense of our uh, territory. Now we're going to build up our army there. Or we could let the Prussians do all the work. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Um, we'll see what happens. All right. And uh, allying the Prussians may not be a bad idea. We'll have to see. I don't know if I really want to ally them. It'd be something we definitely have to break in the future. But we do have a common enemy. Okay, let's see these guys roll through. Alright, we, we did detect them. Get in with this guy. Get in with this guy. Fix up our troops. We have 83. Um. Hmm. Let's have a chat with Prussia. They're unfriendly, but like an alliance could help us both. Okay, he doesn't even want to try it. Okay. All you can do is try. We did get a settlement forecast around West Prussia, and this place is fully done, so what else? Um, replacing some troops. We got some time. Let's go ahead and march down here and attack him. 546 against 42. This is actually so small of a battle, I'm just going to accept it. Fix up all troops. Yep, we're gonna make sure we do all these ticks again. There you go. Um, the choices are fairly slim on what to do and where to go. Preferably here. I'm just going to go ahead and put these guys here. I'm going to go ahead and select to do the Great Parliament. That's going to give me quite a bit to work with. We're going to go ahead and switch this guy, or flip, uh, excuse me, fix these guys. Research, we're two away from having uh, Krakow take utilitarianism. Utilitarianism. Oh, I can't even say it. Utilitarianism. There we go. All these guys are doing really well. Let's see. He's probably going to raid. It's just hard to tell. But Prussia's doing what I would think he would do. Alright. Guys going east. Alright, Russia. Do something, you know, useful with that army. Go south or something. Right. That is going to be a bummer. It's going to be hard to watch. You know, we have a long trade route with Russia developed. Okay, these guys are okay. We're, we're good. Come on. All right. All right, this is... Unfortunately sabotaged. Let's go ahead and pull this guy over. 
Um, this does give us our full stack of units. And apparently they're trying to recruit another one. Gotta admit, I must have gone one over by accident. Um, one, two... to get rid of this because it did me no good in the last battle. This is my younger guy who is great for defense we found out. Agent recruited a rake in Poland. Let's send that rake down here. Yeah, building sabotage we found out about. Okay, recruitment report, all those guys in Poland. They're frugal and thrifty. This guy is going to go here when the time comes. We'll take this, start fixing it all up to my side. Um, we are going to build out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a ninth. Right. Sucks that I have to do that work, but it's okay. Is there anything that can be built? No. Okay, in the turn. Gosh, that battle really was unexpected, guys. I have to admit. I really didn't think that was going to happen. So I'm putting an army that's going to be on defense in the capital. Um, that's just how I feel like that should go. And we'll see how we work from there. It's more because I'm a little worried about Prussia, actually. Um, Prussia's gonna have has some big stacks. They're going to he's a war with Austria, but he may see me as an equal threat. So my job's gonna be very simple. Stop them both. And if I only end up, end up using one army, that's all I do. Right? I had a guy on defense the whole time. Again? All right, we're going to bring this guy down to here. This guy gets a mistress here. We have an enemy raid, enemy raid. And then a recruitment report in Poland. Uh, no, you're going to stay here, buddy. He's already got his 10. And we're marching for Transylvania. With a force that has very little... Um, very little rank here. This army here. There's just a thing of demi cannon. We're gonna go hit it. Shouldn't have been much to hurt us. Let's go back. Fix it. Fix it. Luckily, they hit that when they did. We're getting the upgrades there, upgrades there, upgrades there. Out here we'll get the upgrades for 8,000. This place has no wall yet, so we should just be able to attack it and get rid of everything on it. Um, over here we'll need upgrades, and then we're done upgrading our initial territory. All right, in the turn. Okay. Austria is actually pulling some troops back, it looks like. He must realize how futile it is to hold that. If I could afford a third army, I'd do it. Um, and I'd end up using that army to the south. I could already see it. They're gonna, they would come in there and go for like Hungary or something. That's what's going to make things so difficult. It's because Hungary is so close to Austria's capital. So we'd have to find any way we can to weaken them while not taking off Prussia. Eventually we're going to get the upper hand. Our economy is going to be better than theirs, I think. Even though we can't trade with anybody yet. That'll come in time. Okay, we got utilitarianism. Great. 
We're going to change from utilitarianism, or from the philosophy line, over to common land enclosures. Start getting those. Poland's building up its troops. These things are getting done. We're at 7190. All right, we're looking fine to me. Um, you to here. 954 against 522. We're going to do this one at the start of the next episode, guys. So um, I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. It, it was a pretty eventful second episode. Um, we're rapidly going about it here. Hope you guys are having a, you know, had a, you guys enjoyed it. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't done that already, as well as hit the uh, notification bell. Uh, comment, go to Discord, tell me something, you know, come join us on Discord. There's a lot going on over there. Uh, the link for that's in the description below. And don't forget, we're trying to get 20, 25 likes on every single video in the series. So hit that like button for me and I will see you all next time.